Welcome to the setup guide for using the Stuart Title Integration in Lawyer Conveyance System. This video is meant to be short and to get you started quickly. If you prefer to read the guide, note that there is also a written version of this guide available in the description of this video. With this in mind and without wasting any time, let's get into it. Start by clicking the Settings link in the top right corner of the screen and a menu will appear. If you do not see Manage Users as an option, then this means you are not an admin. Recall that admins are the only users in your account who will have access to the full settings. This includes setting up Stuart. Please contact your account admin and ask that they make you one as well. When in doubt, contact customer support at support at lawyerconveyance.ca. Assuming that you can see the Manage Users button, go ahead and click it. Here you will see a list of all the users in your account. Next, we will authenticate each user separately using their Stuart title username and password. Authenticating lawyers and law clerks are done differently. We will make sure to emphasize the differences. Let's begin with authenticating a lawyer. Click the Stuart button on the nearest lawyer account in this table and a pop-up will appear. The most important difference between a lawyer and a law clerk is a profile ID. The profile ID is a third credential, meaning that it is not the same as the username. Stuart typically expects this profile ID to be made of digits only. Each lawyer will have their own unique profile ID. If you do not know the lawyer's profile ID, please contact your local Stuart rep and they will be happy to get back to you with that information. We will type in the profile ID here and then we will click Save. Next, click the Authenticate Stuart User button and we will be redirected to a page on Stuart's website. Here you can supply the lawyer's username and password. Then you can sign in. Wait until you see the green check mark and the success message. If you are presented with a red X, then you may contact our customer support. You may now exit the tab and return back to the Manage Users page. Congratulations, you just set up a Lawyer Stuart profile and Lawyer Conveyance System. You should use what you learned here on all the lawyers in your account. The last thing to learn is how to set up a law clerk. To begin, click the Stuart button on one of the law clerks in the table, and a pop-up will appear. As you can see, there is no profile ID, so we can go right to clicking the Authenticate Stuart User button to get redirected. Here, you may either supply the law clerk username and password, or more commonly, you can supply the credentials of any lawyer in your account. Then, when you submit this, you will be redirected back to Lawyer Conveyance System, and we should see the green check mark. We will exit the tab and return back to the Manage Users page. That is how you add a law clerk, and you can now take what you learned and apply it to all the law clerks in your account. Once everyone has been authenticated, you should rarely ever have to do this again. Some reasons for this would be if a user updated their password or the account expired. Don't worry though, you will be notified if this happens through a warning message. If you have any questions regarding the material that you learned today, you can reach out to our support team by giving us a call or by emailing us at support at lawyerconveyance.ca. Thank you and have a nice day.